Yeshomati nandana prajapara nagara gokula ramya kana. Cambridge 105. Community radio in your city. So Cambridge's cultural scene is in for a spiritual boost uh, with the city's first Hare Krishna festival in several years. Uh, the International Society for uh, Krishna Consciousness are teaming up with uh, Cambridge University's Krishna Consciousness Society to organise the event. It takes place tomorrow night at the West Road Constant Hall at uh, 7 o'clock. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the event for people who aren't familiar with it? Because it's the first one in, in, in many, many years to take place in the city. Yes, uh, it's been a few years since we've been here. It's a cultural evening, uh, there'll be some music, dance, a uh, little theatre, uh, some philosophy, a little uh, explanation about yoga, meditation and the ancient spiritual culture of India. Uh, there'll be a little bit of film and some vegetarian refreshments also. What did you think of it? I thought it was life enhancing. Beautiful. Yes, very uplifting. Everyone seemed to transcend themselves. It's true, it was, it was magical. Some lovely dancing. Uh, I can't resist the dance. To dance is to praise God. And I did that for nearly four days at the Big Green Fair. And your kind lot, in actual fact, put food and water around me and said, Hare Krishna, people. I went, well, I'll have to go and say thank you. And I did. And so, yeah, I find a lot of you people are very spiritual. And my name is Kazuko. From, I'm, I lived in Cambridge now, but in, from Japan. When I was uh, young, about 40 years ago, so I'm, I have a very nice record in Hare Krishna. I loved every day I had to send. I asked, I want to buy. Nobindang Hare Kunisham, Samundari, Nobindang. I remember this song. Fantastic. You're, you're quite good at singing as well. Thank you so much, Dan. I didn't expect to speak, but uh, I'm George Papers, and uh, I'm a councillor for the Cambridge City, for the Cambridge City Council. I'm also the deputy mayor. I am. I feel very privileged and honoured to be invited uh, to the Hare Krishna, Krishna event. And uh, we, as the city of Cambridge, we are delighted to host such a wonderful event. Thank you so much for inviting us. I have enjoyed thoroughly. The, the songs and the dancing. I look forward to more dancing and more enjoyment. I am of the age that I remember Hare Krishna in the 70s and I really enjoyed it then and I'm sure I'm enjoying it now. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. I enjoyed the whole experience. It was really very, very nice. I, I came with a reasonably open mind but I, I was pleasantly surprised and it was really nice. Yeah, it's very and, interesting. And, 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 it was kind of all levels, yeah. so yeah. yeah. So sort of, I suppose well, like on a, on a sort of a cultural thing, but did you did you did you pick up any of the philosophy or anything at all? Did you think it was well, interesting? Yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, I was I, I would be reasonably well in tune with with you know what, what what was being what was being said and and that sort of you were asking the question of those people. Well, it's a body and mind. It's all it's all together, and uh, that yeah. experience is is, yeah. is, is is really good. Yeah. Things happen in here, huh? many spiritual yeah, yeah. like this, but I, sometimes I felt so and this to, tonight so and many people in, and in, enjoy, I think. Thank you, thank you very much indeed, and a good singing. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. So as we are living in this body and it's changing through these stages, so similarly at that time of death, it's not the end of our existence as we've experienced these, these changes of body, uh, death simply means a fresh set of bodies. It means a new start, a new birth in whatever body we will get in the next life. So this knowledge 
which Prabhupada was speaking so confidently, is coming down by what is called disciplic succession or Guru Parampara, like, how do you say, from master to disciple, master to disciple. Just like a mango in India is passed down carefully from one hand to another hand and to another hand to the market. Because it's a very valuable thing. Thank <laughs> you.